But MG, we need to have a conversation. Yep. You arrived in Brisbane yesterday. I did. Uh, Tony, digital Tony producer Charlie and I had been up here since Monday. Yep. You got you got in. We did the show. We got to the hotel, and then we went out and yep. had some drinks and we, had dinner. We had a great little afternoon. I, I thoroughly enjoyed it. Beautiful. The, the night. rain came. The rain poured. Yeah, it was a storm came through. Beautiful evening down at the Howard Smith Wharves, Felons Brewery down there. Felons Brewery. It was brewery. It, it was brewery. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Yeah, it's a second time. That's okay, but. We need to... There was an incident. There was. There was an incident. Yeah, it's, it's a good incident, but it's a funny incident. <laughs> well, okay. I arrived... I met you at Trivia Night. We That's did right. trivia down there. Yep. And when I got there, you were wearing a a felon's T-shirt. Mm. A T-shirt, obviously, you'd bought from the brewery. You'd had dinner there. Well, I didn't buy it. I, I was going to buy it because I liked the, the cut of the shirt. Yeah. Um, and I saw the workers and the security guards mm. there with, with them on. Yes. Um, but they had the white ones and I asked for the black one. Yep. And, um, basically what happened to the girl, um, said they're $25. Mm-hmm. And then in that time, I think she's gone off and said, this bloke wants this. And I think someone might've recognized me. And uh, she come back and said, this is a gift on the house. Okay. So you've stolen a t-shirt and <laughs> I, put, you've, I put it straight on. You've stolen a t-shirt. You've put it straight on. So you're rocking this black tight felons t-shirt. Yeah. And then we're, we're at the barrel hall, which is where the trivia was. Yep. And what did you start doing out the front of this place? Okay, so we, uh, it's about a 50-metre walk from where we were to the trivia. Yep. So on the way down there, I was, we're walking. It started to pour. We've jumped under an umbrella. Myself, Toby, my mate yes. from Sydney, and, and Tony. And as we're standing there, I noticed that people were doing their QR check-in codes <laughs> on the on the little you know, board right near me. And I, I took it upon myself to act like I was a security guard. Because you looked like one. <laughs> I did look like one. You did look like Everybody one. Everybody's looking at me for a little bit of guidance. I said, you need any help there, Dale? You right, mate? And then one kid come through with his, his QR code out. I said, mate, you got any ID? You did not ID <laughs> I did, him. I did. You can't ID the bloke. Okay. He goes, yep. He goes, I'm 30, but I said, mate, well, I'm not a security guard. So, you... <laughs> <laughs> now, so I kind of, I played that role most of the night because that, then we went to the trivia. Yes. And the, the lady in charge of the trivia floor. She looked at me with she had, had the earpiece in. I'm thinking, uh oh, I'm going to get in a bit of trouble here. I think <laughs> masquerading. I, 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 think I, I think the jig's guard. up. Yes. She's come over and she looked at me and kind of whispered. She goes, "Are you on tonight?" Oh. I, and I just winked. I said, "I just winked at her." I went, "Yep, all good." <laughs> so she goes, as you, as "She said drinks are on us." <laughs> As you ordered three pints, <laughs> she said drinks are on us. So now, they thought I was an undercover, undercover security guard playing trivia. So I'm oh. looking. So I'm at the back of the room with you guys. Looking at everybody, thinking that I've got this, guys. It's okay. We're under control. That is, you have turned up to Brisbane in Magic Round and pretended to be security. Now, confirm this last thing for me, though. There was an incident where a young man, excited about getting down to do trivia, arrived with his dog. Oh, yes. Okay. So after the first kid went through with the security, there's this couple and their friend. And they've got a dog. And he said to me, hey, mate, um, I rang up before and they said we can have the dog in the trivia. I said, you know what? Not a problem, buddy. Bring it through. Nice, beautiful little boxer. You've waved him through. I said, well, on you go. <laughs> so after about five minutes, we've come in, finished our drinks, walked in. I see this real security guard <laughs> <laughs> holding up this couple and their mate with this dog. So what are you mate, doing? You can't bring and dogs I, in They here. said, the bloke out there said we can bring the dog in. <laughs> I walked in with my hand over my face like, where's our chair? <laughs> well, on behalf of the Rush Hour uh, and fake security guard MG, we would like to apologise to uh, that no poor young done. man. No who, harm was done. No harm was done. In the fact, dog was out free front. Drinks, so yeah, exactly. Yeah, no harm was done to you. Poor bug out to take his dog home. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, oh, that was good fun. That was good.